This being my first time in any college, it was kind of difficult. I just want to find a way back to college. I walked in and I didn't really know what was going to happen. Um, at first, I was sort of lost. For my first year of college, I was very nervous. I felt a little more anxious. I didn't know the process of enrolling in classes. I had these ideas like, oh, they're going to solve all my problems. Are they going to get too deep for me? It's kind of personal or something like that. The questions about the GI Bill or just what time do you get your paychecks or how to make a VA claim, those are the questions that most of us in the military have. Also, I was just doing everything my, <laughs> all by my own, so. Things change and you got to keep up with the information. I think that it's pretty common to be stressed out, especially in a school environment. There's a lot of pressures that are happening, and sometimes we, uh, we keep it inside, or I notice that I've kept it inside. At first, it's, it's just a different excitement. It's starting my life, a new life. I think sometimes we're afraid to reach out if we're having a problem, or we don't even know if we're having a problem sometimes. Um, having a peer mentor was like basically having like a guardian angel right over you. I came in quite a few times and it really opened up my eyes to being more comfortable with uh, mental health itself and understanding that it is very important for all of us. From the very beginning they just helped me out. I felt like there was someone that was listening to me and, and I cared. They know what you're going through and they're still going through the same struggle inside and outside of school. It was almost like taking a backpack off, you know, like all of a sudden I felt much more lifted and, and it was easier to go to class. My peer mentor was very kind-hearted. She was very, very supportive. I just didn't feel that there was that many people here to help me and, and I came to find out that there is, there is a group that is here to help veterans like myself. I came in and I said, how can I help you guys? And so they, they told me about the peer education program. found the other uh, support network and what they did, it, it just appealed to me the fact that they, they're here to help other veterans and, and I liked it. I wanted to be a part of it. The first idea came from Ruby. It was just a out of out of nowhere statement. Just, oh, you should, you know, like becoming a peer mentor. I could just see you helping others and I could see you being a peer mentor. She really pushed me and she really urged me to be a peer mentor to help others because she could see that that's my passion. I saw how much it helped me and I wanted to be a part of it. Um, what I want to do for a living is helping people and it's such a unique service um, on campus to to be representing that and uh, an advocacy for you know psychological well-being. I think it's something very valuable to other students that they can relate to uh, to us and we can relate to them. It's, it's more more personal when someone asks a question to me and, and I know I want to help them. I just want to become a leader. I just want to become a role model to everybody. It's helped me be much more aware and uh, more comfortable at school. I feel like I have a purpose in my studies now. It's not just going to school and taking classes. It's I'm a part of this, you know, this strengthening people's minds and helping bring awareness to things like suicide or even uh, on the flip side, just being happy and uh, being well. They relate to what we've been through. It's something that everyone can speak for their experiences and they can relate to one another. I'm advocating for everybody's well-being as well as my own, and so I um, help strengthen relationships for sure. From the very beginning, I know this program was, was the one. 